Hello and welcome to Maths with Jacob. This lesson will focus on odd numbers, three operations. Operations with odd numbers. We'll start with addition. The rules for addition of odd numbers are as follows. If you have an odd number and you add another odd number, you get an even number. Here are three perfect examples. Just look at them. Pause the video if you like and have a look at your leisure. If you add three odd numbers together, you get an odd number. Here are the examples. If you add four odd numbers together, you get an even number. And here are two examples. So the rule at the end says, if you add an odd number of odds, you get an odd. If you add an even number of odds, you get an even. Let's look at the first half. If you add an odd number of odds, you get an odd. There are three odds, so it gives you an odd. Now for the even number of odds, there are two odds. See, that's an even number because there are two of them. Two is an even number you get an even. Here are four odds that you're adding together. One, two, three, four. The number four is an even number, so it's an even number of odds, because there are four of them. That gives you an even number. So remember, pause the video at any time to have a closer look at any of those. Subtraction. The rules for subtraction of odd numbers are as follows. Odd minus odd equals even. Have a look at those three examples. Odd minus odd minus odd equals odd. There are three examples. And the last one. Odd minus odd minus odd minus odd equals even. And there are two examples. And the rule says, if you follow the above pattern, an even number of odds gives an even, an odd number of odds gives an odd. Now here's an even number of odds, because there's only two of them, and you follow that pattern. The pattern means that you start off with an odd, and for this simple example, you just subtract one odd. So there's two there, see? That's an even number. So the answer is even. Here's the same pattern again. You start off with an odd, and then you just keep subtracting odds. But here, there are three of those odds. That's why the answer is an odd. We've continued the pattern because we start off with a single odd, and then we keep subtracting. However, this here, see those there? That's an even number of odds, because there are four of them. And that gives you an even number. So pause the video at any time to have a closer look at that. Multiplication. The rules for multiplication of odd numbers are as follows. If you have an odd multiplied by an odd, that gives you an odd. Have a look at those examples. If you have an odd times odd times odd, that gives you an odd. There are three examples. And if you multiply four odds together, you get an odd. And there are the examples. And the rule at the end says, if you can multiply many odds, odd numbers together to get an odd number. So no matter how many odd numbers you multiply together, you will always get an odd number. So they're just three examples to illustrate that fact. So you're in control. Pause the video at any time to have a closer look at any of those.